What is up, everybody? I'm back with another video, man. Today we're going to KSI, and the title is called Deji. So, um, I heard that um he was flaming his brother for um you know the tick the YouTuber versus TikTok mat boxing match, and yeah, if y'all didn't see it, it was just I'm pretty sure he'll explain it in the video, but... Well, Deji, I hope it was you're bad. okay. Uh, don't let the loss get to you <laughs> too much. End of the day, you got paid, and you still have millions of people that love you and your videos. So obviously me, like many other people over the weekend, saw you lose. Now, for me, it was two things. It was very sad, and it was also very disappointing. It was sad Facts. because we truly wanted you. Literally everyone was rooting for you, Deji. Everyone. To win. I can't wait to see Deji win. As long as he trains. If he trains, he'll win. If he doesn't train, he'll get fucking slapped. Who the fuck is Vinny Hacker, man? Deji exactly. slap that motherfucker, bro. She absolutely slap him. And bro, Deji needs to train and slap him so hard, Deji could fight fucking anyone. We've watched you for years. We've seen you grow from this little kid playing scary games with me to... The adult you've become now so to see you lose it it really hurt me man and it, i'm sure it hurt many people uh watching as well fool me once shame on you fool me twice <laughs> shame on me fam <laughs> now deji i'm gonna talk to you like no one else will around you because i'm your brother all i want is the best for you i don't want anything from you w I don't brother need anything from you i just want you to do well i want to help you plus you know public videos are the only way that get through to you these days since we don't really talk like that anymore so i'm gonna be real with you your work ethic is terrible terrible I, bro. i'm disappointed in your team and the people around you man how and why they thought it would be a good idea for you to enter the ring looking like that is be <laughs> Bro, no, no, no. Facts, bro. Did y'all see the other, like, the other dude was, bro, this is not in shape at all, bro. At all, bro. At all. And for a boxing match, bro, you don't know how much in shape you have to be, bro? Like, what? Beyond me. It was, it was embarrassing. Have they yeah, no shape? Yeah, it really was embarrassing. Are they there just to massage your ego while you're still paying them and giving them clout? For that fight, you weren't fit. You at weren't all. You weren't fit enough at all. So why would they allow you to enter the ring unfit like that? Deji, man, how the hell have you managed to look worse in your redemption fight? That's <laughs> like as if AJ, after losing to Andy Don't Ruiz, decides, oh, let me fight Tommy boxing. Fury. And then he loses again. Do you know how ridiculous that is? And it's not like as if Tommy Fury just beat him. Tommy Fury annihilated him. Do you know how unbelievable that is? You were in better shape fighting Jake Paul than you were fighting <laughs> Vinny Hacker. How can you actually oh my God. be proud to jump on that scale looking like this? Facts. We were all expecting you to show off your abs after all the hard work you've been doing. Then he was talking about some he training five times a day, bro. And putting in because he gas bro if y'all didn't know bro he gas out in the first round bro in the second round it was so bad he literally took a knee took a knee after having a round break bro after having a one minute break bro and the rounds not even it's two minute rounds and it's only five rounds bro like come on bro no time to prove all the haters wrong after training five times a day and instead <laughs> we get a junk food figure and fam you're using the same excuse that you used against Jake. You said that you gassed out in the Jake fight. That's why you lost. So we accepted that. So if you gassed out in the first fight, what should your main priority be to get your cardio up, bro? But yeah, and we said cool. it was in your next fight. Hopefully, you gassing out shouldn't be a problem Fact. at all. With the fight against Vinny Hacker, they niced you. They gave you two minute rounds, and it was only five rounds. <laughs> exactly, and somehow, that's literally what I just said. You gassed out quicker. <laughs> <laughs> it took you only two I rounds watch the Jake Paul to gas out this time. I mean, please it. make it make sense. <laughs> It's crazy because you are so talented, man. Back in the day, you were so fast and explosive. And yes, you never needed to work hard. You were just naturally good at running and sports or whatever the fuck you wanted to do. But hard work beats talent every single time, Deji. Deji, Thanks. I'm not talented at all. You are more talented than me. But fuck me, bro. I work 
way harder than you. And now, you've officially become an easy stepping stone. People would happily fight you now. Your big credible oh, name God. to bro, boost an opponent's career. I would fight career, Desi, bro. <laughs> and you're an easy fight. Because we all know your stamina is worse than Snorlax. All you need to do is survive, what, two rounds? And then we all know that you're going to just do the knee for Black Lives Matter <laughs> and then give up. Damn, you bro, Black that's, bro, he literally took a knee. In the beginning of the round, he was that tired after having a one-minute break, bro. I'm, I was like, bro. I thought he got injured because, like, who? Bro, I've never seen that before, bro. Never in my life seen someone take a knee because they were so People tired. People a hundred years with that loss. After that loss, I slept and I had a dream about me being in Cornfield. <laughs> you came out looking like Mike Tyson and ended up looking like Solomon in 12 years a slave. You came through to the ring wearing a cross. But even Jesus couldn't save you. <laughs> Jesus helps those that help themselves. Mm -hmm. And you didn't. <laughs> you simply did not help yourself at all. You were the only YouTuber to lose in the whole that is, card. That is really bad, you, bro. Like me, can this... He was the only YouTuber to lose, bro. The only one. The only one, Frodo, bro. disappointed. Now, not to take anything away from Vinny Hacker, because clearly... That man worked hard. Clearly, that man trained Facts. and ultimately wanted to win it more than you. He got a he knockout on you, bro. took the fight seriously. So, congratulations, Vinny Hacker. But let's be real, Deji. You lost to an anime character. <laughs> and came to the ring with a Naruto soundtrack. As oh, God. He came, on, he came in the ring. He, he came in with the pain theme song, bro. If this was the season finale, you lost to someone that likes to clean mm. and dance in their spare time. And shout out to Vinny for being a sportsman after the fight and making sure you were alright, but God damn, Deji, what in hell? And I don't care if anyone thinks I'm being harsh. I'm your brother, okay? I'm gonna tell you how it is. Because Facts. clearly, no one around you cares, else they would never have let you lose like that. They didn't even that have time so to bad. throw in the towel this time. You just have a bunch of yes men and women all around you that don't challenge anything you say or do. Like, did you even run during the camp? Did you, did you use a treadmill? Did you have a, a nutritionist? Did you have a physio? Did you, did you have a hard spa? Did you ever lose a spa? Did you do any cardio or did you just work on the left cross the whole fucking time? And what was your plan B when that failed? I'll tell you what it was. You gave up. Did you honestly take this fight seriously? Vinny Hagen said that he was just all. doing this fight for the money, but... If you were a neutral and you didn't know anything, bro, how much money did they get paid? I still want to know. the bro, person I still doing know, the fight for the money. You thought you could bully Vinny. You thought you could intimidate him with your power. <laughs> <laughs> you thought you were going to make him give up, but he didn't. Mine said, fuck that. I, I got the Naruto Pain theme tune running through my veins. <laughs> and he fought back. Vinny Hacker was ready for round three. While you were busy trying to summon some energy from every black leader <laughs> with that name <laughs> from Martin Luther King to Malcolm X to Nelson Mandela. You legit had a one minute break after a round and said, nah, fuck that. I need more. <laughs> and then you took a knee. I've never seen that in my life. Bro, I literally I just said that. It. Ultimately, at the end of the day, you closed up and you gave up. Dirty man. Don't ever box again. Don't ever box again until you work on your cardio. Oh, okay, Here's a okay. challenge for you, Didge. Try doing a 10K without stopping. Is that possible? Is that too much to ask? Because maybe then I'll know that you're somewhat serious about working out. Maybe then I'll know you have... What is it? A 10K is like... What is that like? I know it's like three or four miles probably, right? I mean, I've ran a 5K without stopping, but a 10K? That sounds... Some self-discipline or some work rate. It's not about what trainer you have, Deji. It's the problem is you. You don't know yeah. hard work if it punched you in the face. And it punched you so many times in the Jake fight. So yeah, I feel sorry for you. I I, I want you to do well. But it, bro, it really They was clowning him, bro. Like, bro, this this was a really bad look, bro. A really bad look. I can't lie, Deji is all on you. Why do you think I'm in the position I'm in today? Why do you think I'm so successful? Because I'm lazy? I'm a black man. I have to work two, three, four times as hard as a normal person Say just that. to gain the same success. Many might call it unfair, but that's just how it is. So deal with mm. it. Don't just fucking Facts. complain all the time. Put in that work and win. You can't 
cheat boxing, did you? Because oh eventually, God, you when can't. you get in that ring, we all find out who really worked the hardest. Oh God, you said that oh you God. train five times a day. Where? <laughs> in Facts. McDonald's. Five times a day, looking like this. You're delusional. You want to get out of my shadow, start putting in that work. It's as simple as that. When you finally figure that out, watch your life change for the better. And yeah, that's it. That's it. Spin your but yeah, bro. That's going to be the end of this video, bro. He was spitting straight facts. I can't lie.